and uh, 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 we will ensure that yav prohibitory order ide adu sariyagi ellanu palisbeku iga Some interest in the Tau Kelta Ediri about this case of RR Nagar constituency. Now, at this stage, because police second police case is a register, police investigation, Nartaide Matu Ella reports, Manya Election Commission of India. Back into that once uh, he starts speaking again, got a bit of a problem with an audio glitch earlier, but that's uh, uh, the election commission, uh, commission, the poll panels, news briefing that's taking place. He had just, uh, just about started talking about the entire voter ID controversy from RR Nagar right now, speaking about the police investigation which is currently on. Uh, and all details have been submitted regarding this to the uh, says the deputy election to the deputy election commission of india right now it doesn't look like they have taken any concrete decision or have any concrete information to share with the media about who is behind that entire planned so called conspiracy how did anybody get access to such a big amount of voter genuine voter ids uh, the Congress and the BJP have, uh, of course, ex uh, ex exchange charges. That will uh, uh, vitiate the process of decision making. Internal communications are not discussed. Okay. At appropriate time when some decisions are taken and more definitive because investigation has now started. Because so much of document was there that preliminary inquiry by district authorities took lots of time. So yesterday late night only they could register the second case which is the main case in the whole thing. So that case is now under investigation. Police is doing their job. Let us wait for some time. Okay. What we've been getting are versions of the Yeah, second case is regarding that uh, uh, we have found uh, so many epic card in that because first case was only a, 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 a group clash. So those were private complaints. But this second case is with reference to this uh, uh, discovery of very large number of genuine epic card. Now, after due inquiry by that RO and the district election officer that is BBMP commissioner, we can say that because they have verified more than 800 card thoroughly and 100% they are genuine, 100% they are original cards, some of them are issued as long back as 2012. So they are very old over the period 2012, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. It is not something manufactured today or printed today or they are anything new. There is no, with emphasis we can say that there is no any kind of compromise with the integrity of the electoral uh, uh, whatever our list is there. The Mat Patti and 
ಮತ್ತು ಪಟ್ಟಿಯಲ್ಲಿ ಯಾವುದೇ ರೀತಿಯ ಸಮಸ್ಯೆ ಇಲ್ಲ ದಟ್ ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಬಿ ಕಂಪ್ಲೀಟ್ಲಿ ರೂಲ್ಡ್ ಔಟ್ ಬಿಕಾಸ್ ಮೋರ್ ದ್ಯಾನ್ ಏಟ್ ಹಂಡ್ರೆಡ್ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಬೀನ್ ಥಾರಲಿ ವೆರಿಫೈಡ್ ಹಂಡ್ರೆಡ್ ಪರ್ಸೆಂಟ್ ದೆ ಆರ್ ಬಿಕಾಸ್ ದೀಸ್ ಆರ್ ವೆರಿ ಲಾರ್ಜ್ ನಂಬರ್ ಇಟ್ ವಿಲ್ ರಿಕ್ವೈರ್ ಲಾರ್ಜ್ ಲಾಂಗ್ ಟೈಮ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಲಾರ್ಜ್ ನಂಬರ್ ಆಫ್ ಪೀಪಲ್ ಟು ಬಿ ಡಿಪ್ಲಾಯ್ಡ್ ಟು ವೆರಿಫೈ ಥಾರಲಿ ವಾಟ್ ಎಕ್ಸಾಕ್ಟ್ಲಿ ಇಟ್ ಈಸ್ ವೆದರ್ ಇಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಮ್ಯಾಚಿಂಗ್ ವಿತ್ ಸಮ್ ಅಪ್ಲಿಕೇಶನ್ and no see every detail cannot be but what you are telling that yes sitting ml is accused that is a fact that is a fact so for clarity and you know the chief election commission about now case yeah this is the chief how many accused are there sir sir can you please list total number of accused and is muni ratna in the fir is he listed his name is there please clarify hmm. yes or no this or this emphatic yes how many times you want uh, it it is so what we are hearing are yes. versions of the political party it is it to is to keep it transparent can you give a chronological order of the incidents that happened so that you know there is no shadow on the election commission and the ceo zone no what uh, a chronological uh, event you want so the union minister said that see, those are see the union minister a fact listen a fact can only be verified by investigation investigation is going on and fir is a fact so what section fir have fir, have FIR is a fact so fir is a fact which is very much there so mention the section sir please sir how many accused are there and how many accused what is the chronological order and what are the sections we will see at at at, at this stage giving all details may be prejudicial to the investigation but uh, fir are in very large number of uh, sections what are the sections sir it it ranges from uh section 120 b 171 e 171 f sir slowly sir we have to write down can you pronounce it slowly 120 b ka 120 b 171 e 171 f 188 red with 123 125-127-8 120B 171E 171F 188 red with 34 IPC and 123 125 127A 135a 1c of representation of people's act 1951 and the case is being investigated by an officer a senior officer of the level of deputy commissioner of police okay we will come up with uh, exact exact uh, picture with see at this stage discussing more thing will jeopardize the investigation we will come up with more facts
सिस्टमैटिक earlier also we have emphasized this is a case of systematic survey systematic survey of each household in the constituency to find out their personal details systematic survey of each household and persons in the constituency to find out their personal details like what is their name or caste or even requirement in terms of uh, whether they require any type of uh, widow card or old age, old age pension or or they require uh, a, a food card or anything else so it is like a systematic survey and what is prima facie there that these surveys are even photos are there of the houses photos of of people are there and based on their requirement their cards are collected epic cards and uh, uh, they are probably given some things inducements etc so systematically it is for influencing the voters that is very much there that yesterday also we had said that is the precise case so it is a very serious matter that there is a systematic survey and uh, 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 at this stage about investigation more things discussing or telling in the press meet is not salutary for the investigation let us wait for it yes that's why emphatically emphatically i said uh, that there are 12 different documents which are valid for voting but see let us wait and just see what uh, is uh, further decisions etc okay so bjp according to sir according to election commission rules well the election commission they are clearly not uh, very forthcoming and willing to divulge too many details of the status of the investigation it took a lot of insistence uh, and repeated questioning from the journalists who had gathered there for him to go back to the core issue uh, about the voter ids that have been found and what exactly has happened there this is what we have uh, managed to uh, get from him as information and facts that yes uh, the the voter ids have been verified about 800 odd but they have uh, no reason to believe that the rest are not genuine so they all seem to be genuine voter ids a second fir has now been filed in connection to the voter ids remember the first one wasn't really about what they had found but more about what had happened there and the clashes that took place he has also more importantly mentioned that the congress mla muniratna is in fact named in that fir and then he has gone on to give the details of the fir it's uh, uh, and the sections that have been booked but clearly there is no clarity on who wanted to collect all this data and if it was simply for voter profiling considering that even pictures of people's houses and all the data about them including the electricity meter their caste and everything was uh, those details were also present so whether this was just voter profiling or uh wh whether there was a motive for bribery and voter inducement is not something that the election commission has said today he though says that these people can continue to vote uh using other identification uh, documents uh they can they will be allowed to vote day after tomorrow